Remember that one time Kristen got a desk makeover? Well, I had a blast helping to bring her workspace to life, and I want to do it too, but to my bedroom. Yeah, I want to actually make magic happen in there. It's ladylike, and I'm getting a bedroom makeover. With Kane! Thanks for having me back. What did we do before? We decorated Kristen's desk. Yeah. And now we're doing your bedroom, finally. <laughs> I want a bedroom makeover because I hate my room. It is a drab, dusty personal hell. It's not actually dusty, but it just gives me dusty vibes. Also, the color of my walls kind of suck. I get very overwhelmed. Like, I actually really love interior design. I love watching HGTV shows. I watch a lot of YouTube stuff, like on home decorating. But then when it comes time for me to execute, I just get overwhelmed and then I give up immediately. So she has a vanity and it's half set up, but she does her makeup in the bathroom. Right, because there's no mirror. So we're gonna fix that, get her a nice place to do your makeup. I think some like rugs for comfort. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There's like one ceiling light and I was in there for a few hours and it was just like not super flattering. It's not flattering, it's harsh. <laughs> I kind of just leave my bedroom door shut at all costs when I have company over because yeah. I hate it. So in your apartment, what have you decorated so far? The little bit that I have decorated, I've put that energy into the common areas. Maybe like you focus on the common area because that's what people see. Yeah. And you haven't spent time to take care of yourself. And I feel like you're so busy and you do a lot of good work and you you have a cat to take care of. You need time to just escape. That's exactly what I want. I just want a little escape. I want to walk into my bedroom and be like, ah. I want color. Yeah. I want personality. Yeah. I want lots of plants. If you were to think of some words to describe the vibe, what would those words be? Jungle. Okay. With a touch of Palm Springs. By the pool, right? Yeah, like pool vibes. Like I want to feel relaxed. Like I want to feel like I have nothing to do. I would say I spend about 10% of my time at home in my bedroom. The other 90% I spend in the living room. My hope is that at the end of this, you'll be meditating in there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I have stuff that I need to get done before we actually get to decorating, right? Which is getting rid of some things. You're just gonna see what sparks joy. If it doesn't, it goes out of the bedroom. We're gonna make some magic happen in this bedroom. Not between us, but <laughs> you know. <laughs> All right. This is the stuff I've gotten rid of from my closet. So Freddie cleared out a giant chunk of her closet, so her go-to won't be to leave boxes on the floor. She'll put it in the closet and it'll be clean, right? Yes. It's always a work in progress because when I clean out my closet, it just makes me feel like I can shop more, which is not correct. Now I have to tackle my dresser. Kane told me that he wants me to get all four of these empty. I've already gotten rid of a lot of stuff, that's why this is hard. These were foldable boxes that I had clothes sitting in and they were visible to the eye. I got rid of those and then I got these to slide under my bed because all the storage needs to be concealed. So I put all my clothes in there. So this is my shoe trunk. You guys have seen it before. Those are all the shoes I'm gonna get rid of. And these are all the shoes I'm gonna keep. That's pretty good, right? basically looked up a bunch of keywords like pink, tropical, Palm Springs into Pinterest and just selected all the photos that we think we would want inspiration from. We are shopping. Today is shopping day. Yeah, this is my dream come true. It is. Our first stop is Bed Bath & Beyond. One of Kane's priorities is to get me a really comfortable comforter. Yeah. How soft is it? I mean, this is incredible. Gold is gonna be a pretty prominent part of the color scheme, so this will be really nice. So we finished at Bed Bath & Beyond. We're looking for some curtains. So this is like a sheer curtain to create like a heavenly vibe through the window. And then this green one is minty and it has like the bohemian-ish pattern. Kane is insisting that I get this white rug. I'm obsessed. Imagine the softest things you've ever felt and this is softer than that. What have we here? It's a plant. Pot. It's very pretty. Now we're gonna head downtown to go look at some plants. Yeah, cause pretty one in that jungle vibe. Yeah, I'm very stressed out by this. I was even stressed out last night looking at stuff online. I was just like, there's just so many things. There's so many pieces to the puzzle. I just feel like I don't have the mental bandwidth to do it, which is why I'm happy you're here. For me, the lighting and the plants are probably the biggest thing. Mm -hmm. And once those are taken care of, everything is just like logistics. And if they don't work out, it's fine. Yeah. We're going to the giant warehouse with 
a ton of fake plants like anything you can ever think of. You look like you're in the jungle right now. <laughs> Hey, that's what you wanted. This is what I wanted. Maybe I should just move in here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we got trees. We got trees. This giant one. It's very jungly and also it looks like a Dr. Seuss tree when you see it. So we're going to look for some last minute things. I'm tired. It's been a long day. I rarely shop in real life. I usually do everything online and this is throwing your girl for a loop. Really? I love shopping. This is actually not, this is, this is not long. This is lightweight. Yeah. We also got my favorite brand of candles, Chesapeake Bay. They basically have really cute feelings on them, like peace and tranquility, and like confidence and joy. <laughs> Reflection and clarity. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. Wait, wait, it's wait. A yes for me. Simplicity and hope. Oh, that's sweet. Do you like it? Yeah. Joy and laughter. That one's great. The rest of the stuff that we came here for, we're gonna just shop online. Yeah. Yeah. That's a great option. There's still work to be done, but... Yeah, but we got a lot done. We got a lot done today. It's decorating day. Everything's like stuffed in Freddie's living room right now, ready to be put in. Freddie wanted Palm Springs by the pool in the middle of a jungle. Yes, self-care paradise. An oasis, if you will. I got my TV in my room, so that's a big deal. So I got a handyman to come over and install the curtain rods and install the TV mount so I can put my TV in my damn room. I knew that Freddie spends a lot of time in the living room because the TV is there. So mm -hmm. having a TV to just kind of check into whenever she wants is important. Lady like is gonna come at the end of the day to yeah. check out and toast on the space and yeah. give some of their reviews. We only have about six hours to yeah. decorate. I've actually never put up wallpaper before. Me neither. All right, should we get started? Let's, yeah, let's do it. Let's not waste any more time. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. This kind of stuff always makes me nervous. Yeah. First, we applied temporary wallpaper behind my bed. The wallpaper's from Chasing Paper. Wallpaper's done. Yeah, it took an hour and a half, which isn't that bad. We cleared out as much of the dresser as possible and moved it to the dining room area to free up some bedroom space. I donated the shoes I didn't need and then got rid of the boxy shoe trunk. Then we transferred the remaining shoes into the gold storage ottoman that I already had. Next, we repositioned the bed and then brought in the two nightstands. Yeah. These were from allmodern.com. It's really nice to have the bed be centered, so then when you walk in the room, it's more impactful to have like a bit more symmetry. And so we centered the bed, and then we put in two nightstands that match the headboard. They're bold, they're blocky, and I don't know, they kind of give me like a fancy hotel vibe. Yeah, it's like a tropical vacation vibe. Mm -hmm. We got lots of lamps. We got one, two, three, four, five lamps. The light bulbs are all Philips Hughes, and they can change to any color you want. When you want to feel like you're waking up, you can change it all to daylight colors, or when you're feeling like a more intimate vibe. You can change it to like red, purple, maroon. Uh, you can dim it to whatever you want. The two gold ones next to her vanity are from Bed Bath & Beyond. And then there's one tall one next to this mirror, which is from TJ Maxx. Yeah, and this one is to light when she's taking Instagram outfit photos. Yes, and best believe I did some test shots in front of the mirror to make sure the whole room gave a very nice Instagram background. Did it? It did. We ordered a stool from All Modern, and that's to go with my vanity setup. It'll be nice for me to like sit down and relax and feel luxurious while I'm getting ready to go out or getting ready for a regular day at work. It's a nice cream color and the legs are gold to match the whole gold theme of the room. So I'm really stoked about that. It's also pretty comfortable. Another addition to the vanity area was a mirror from Bed Bath & Beyond. It's kind of like a rolls goldish kind of color. It's pretty big. I like it because I'm going to be able to see like my entire face, like everything that's happening here. We have some artwork from TJ Maxx that we put on the wall to match her bedding. It's like a pink in tone and it also has a plant in it and Freddie likes cactuses too. That helps balance the background for when she takes photos in her Instagram wall to bounce back from the mirror. Yes. We also got a fan palm tree and planter from All Modern to decorate the Instagram selfie corner. We got a furry white runner from allmodern.com that we put in between the bed and the window for extra cushion. With the curtains, she can close it all the way to get some privacy or she can leave just the sheer one in there and that'll kind of diffuse part of the sunlight in so it feels more like heavenly. We got a new white sheet set, soft comforter, and a pleated duvet cover in blush pink from Bed Bath & Beyond. We got the decorative pillows in pink, green, and white in soft textures for the bed from Bed Bath & Beyond and TJ Maxx. Roberta loves the rug apparently. Mm -hmm. It's so soft the moment I touched it, I was in love. It's memory foam and like soft faux fur. And Roberta approved, so that means that it's perfect. And then we put 
put a few decorations on the nightstand. Usually you don't want to put too many. We put three. Yeah, so there's like a little succulent, but it's inside of like a cat vase. So it's really cute. Y'all know I love cats. And I kind of feel like it definitely flows with the whole ambiance of the room of being planty, kind of LA, Palm Springs, Oasis. I'm gonna have a couple members from Ladylike come and take a look. I'm so excited for them to see this space. Yeah. We're at Freddie's house. Yeah, we're at Frederica's apartment. Just Beautiful Los Angeles, Angeles California. <laughs> Fred is redesigning her bedroom. Mm -hmm. And Freddie likes greens and yellows. I was just told to be here and that there would be rosé. So yeah. that rosé was on the calendar invite. Yep. I do yeah. know Freddie and I have commiserated in the past about how our bedrooms look like shit. Oh. So the reason we're here is to see how much work they've done. We also have pictures of Freddy's room. We've all been in Freddy's bedroom before today also. But it was here. Nice. Yeah, like I don't remember it being shitty. I remember I think there's a lot of fun elements. There's a lot of stuff in it for the amount of space. Yeah. You know what I mean? I think that Fred probably just needs a little more pops of color. Maybe okay, just need more Freddy. Like the bedroom's He's probably gonna Freddy. need a little bit more Freddy. Yeah. Need more Freddy. We have Serena in here, we have Solange in here, but where's Freddy? Where's Fred? Where, Where is Fred? Freddie. Freddie spent all day feathering the nest. And we're here to just, you know, celebrate her and her new We're nest. here to lay some eggs. <laughs> here we go. <gasps> wow, holy wow. shit. Whoa. Oh my god. Whoa. Whoa. Look yeah. at this accent wall. Ah! Oh my god. Is this just the cat? Was it the cat? The cat. Oh, are you okay? Sorry, I was just What just happened? She parkoured out in my arms. <laughs> this, wow, this is beautiful. Oh. This is a damn Whoa, palace. Oh, look at these curtains. And this is so cozy, this rug. It is. It has a little foam. I want to rub my face in it. Wow. <laughs> Shit, now I'm wow. just like, Kane, are, are you available for parties? Literally. Right? <laughs> You're going to feel so much relief having curtains. Yeah, I'm like really happy about it. <gasps> oh, oh, Kane. Good work. Cheers, cheers to Freddy's new cheers, cheers, cheers. Thank y'all so much for coming. Oh Thank you for inviting us. This is lovely. I will stay the night. Thank you. <laughs> I feel wow. reinvigorated. Oh my God, Kane, seriously, you were a god. I just want to like starfish in my bed and just feel good. Yeah. You know? Yeah, it's, yeah, it's you know what I, I like about it? It's luxurious. Yeah, it really is. It's Hollywood. It's yeah. French. It's yeah. Hollywood. It's everything. It's everything. It's everything. It's Paris. It's, it's London. It's Paris. It's Paris. It's Paris. Yeah. Oh! Oh! oh, holy shit. Yeah, turn all red. Ooh. Do all red. Of mm. course, Deb would want all red. <laughs> get in there, get in there. Ooh, oh, I like yeah. the blue because it kind of yeah. goes with the curtains. Oh, yeah. Wow. You're gonna have fun. Oh, yeah, this is, this is <laughs> fight of me, Pete. Ooh. Yeah, see that little shimmy yeah. happening? Yep, yeah. yep. <laughs> well, thank y'all so much. One last cheers. Cheers. To Fred's new room. Yay. Yay. I mean, looking at it, it already makes me feel calm. Yeah. Like, I just wanna fall asleep and take a nap here. <laughs> yeah, I mean, literally, it does look like an Airbnb. It looks like a room that you would rent out, like, on an island or in a very tropical vacation spot. I am so happy. Everything came together so well. I think the bedroom, the final product, really accurately reflects the Pinterest board. You can check out our Pinterest board that we did in the links in the description if you wanna see how it compares. I FaceTimed my mom and showed her my new room, and she was beyond impressed. She barely recognized where I was. Mom approved. She's super excited to come visit. Thank you, Kane. Yeah, I'm excited for you to You're the best. Space. You are the king. The king of interior design and decorating. Thank you. The king. <laughs> the king. Thanks for having me on Ladylike to decorate Kristen and Freddie's spaces. If you like what you see, check out some of the new spaces I'm decorating for deserving individuals on BuzzFeed Video. Coming soon. This is your new living room. <laughs> oh my goodness. Until next time, rest well. You deserve it. Hey Google, turn off the lights. You got it, turning off five lights.
So it's about a week after the room makeover and I've been loving using my vanity. I've actually been sitting here doing my makeup and my hair and it's been so nice because I can just be in one spot and not have to go back and forth to my bedroom. I wake up and I still don't recognize the room. It's so different from what it used to look like. It's so serene. I've been spending so much time in here. Last night I was able to just like watch TV in bed before sleep. <sighs> my life has changed.